Welcome back to Twits Gaming, everyone. My name is Silvermord, and we are continuing with Amnesia the Dark Descent. I am uh, fully aware I am a little bit, uh, a lot. What the heck do I crouch again? Uh, I'll put it away. Oh. How do I crouch with C? X? Q? No. O? Anyway, can I take this book? Nope. Nothing. I need that book. Yes, Tinderbox! Okay, seriously, I thought I could crouch. Can I not crouch? Maybe I just can't crouch there. I thought I could crouch. Whatever. Is that. Is this something? No, that's not something I can have. Is this. Is this something I can have? Anyway, so, uh, I know I'm very, very far behind everyone else as far as uh, the gameplay goes. I mean, this game's been out for how long? And I've, uh... Oh. Oh, oh, oh. I scared myself. I got stuck. And I, uh, I'm only now getting to it. But either way, I mean, I I'd been reluctant because I heard that this was such a, a horribly scary game. Yeah, so, you know, I'm a little reluctant, but I finally got around to playing it, and so far I'm loving it, but I haven't really experienced, uh, uh okay, 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 stop it, there, I have light, okay, calm the fuck down. Constitute as light. Look at, look at the light. Still going insane. No, I. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Oil. There, there's still more stuff there. And tinder boxes. Um. Anyway. I mean, so far I'm loving it. It's uh. Yeah, it's interesting. I'll say that. Much of the castle is old and hasn't been tended to for centuries. When the shadow arrives, it won't take long until things start falling apart. We're just buying time anyway. Let's do what we can. There isn't much to be done about the wars. We should reinforce weak structures. The ground will tremble and there's a risk everything will cave in on us. Especially downstairs. Here. Here and there. Over? Let's get the servants working on it. Can you, can you stop that? You're giving me a headache. Thank you. Didn't know having memories could be so painful. Fragile but not breakable by hand. So I need something that can break it. Can this scroll break it? down look stare at some light jeez oh the haunted book oh so let me get this straight I can I can move the book down and <laughs> this this is why I break games I doubt the book's gonna break You have to be swift when you activate the first one. You hear that? If it stops, you'll have to start over. Isn't all this a bit excessive? You can exactly. never be too careful, Daniel. So I am Daniel. I am legend. Can I take can I take one of these? No, no, okay. Weird. Any 
anything here? Jade! Well, is, it, is this the way out? I don't know. This is the way in, then how the hell do I move it? Ooh, oil. Did something. What other one is there? No, you're not one. Well, oh, and you, and then you. Then are there others? Looks like he has a stick up his butt, but other than that, it's not the boot, it's a key. Blue key. Get in! Is this a scary thing I heard about? I can like, I can like hear it, I hear something. I need to hide. Anyone in there? No. No. I don't know what throwing things at it will do. Why can't I can't why can't I crouch anymore? I could have sworn I could crouch. Again, it's been a little while since. I guess he's not reading to me anymore. Wilhelm and his fools have endangered my research long enough with their absent-minded handling of the human vessels. Human vessels? The sheriff is keeping a watchful eye in the forest and is killing my trusty servants. It's just a matter of time until they follow the trail to Brennenburg. I need to lock Wilhelm and his men up to avoid further investigation from the public. The wine cellar will therefore be sealed off until the matter has been handled. Either the king's men leave, or they will starve. Whatever comes first, they can all rot for all I care. Maybe I will feed them some wine. It would, it would in a sense, solve both of my problems. Well, aren't you a gentleman? I'm good, apparently. <laughs> Can 
case you can't tell, Basil is uh, doing what he does best. Oh, and we love him for it. Did it shatter in my hands? No, thank you. Thank you, Basil. I wanted a cat's head. Basil, this would be significantly easier if you weren't pacing back and forth in front of me. Yes, I love you too. Mm. scary stuff happen. I think it's soon. Feels like it's soon. I think I panicked. Things that I don't see a place to hide.
not enjoying my stay here. going then? I'm so lost. So your book. Oh. Do you understand me, chair? I can crouch. The um... 17th of May, 1839. After pounding the unforgiving stone wall for what seemed like an eternity, I realized it was hopeless. I was trapped. I fell to the ground, gasping for air, trying to focus. That's when I saw a faint blue shimmer. My weakened body was heavy to carry, but I managed to push myself toward the enchanting light. You seem to have a pretty upbeat pace for someone who's dying. It was waiting for me. Enclosed in dark nothingness, I felt myself drawn to the mystic light. It's a crystal ball! I reached out, closing it in my hands. The faint glow escaped my fingers and began to spark brightly and spirit me away, unlocking alien memories of spiraling towers, endless deserts, and impossible geometry. The next thing I can remember is the grating sound of stone being lifted, the voices of the Arabs pulling me to safety, and grasped firmly in my hands was the broken pieces of a most peculiar relic. Why is it snowing? sand trickled from the crumbling stone ceiling and pushed down on the brim of his hat. He braced himself as cavern suddenly shook and settled. Nope. Oh. Oh, what is that? That's disgusting. Man! Don't you guys know how to use a- Oh, it hurts! Don't you guys know how to use a bathroom? all the time I have for this episode. Thank you for joining me on Quits Gaming, and I will see you later.